is that really a problem, though? I mean, I could eat them up. I can also call the Ottomans in to fight them for promise of land, but Iraq have no friends. Might be worth me just smacking a claim down on them and eating them. Looks like the Ottomans are preparing for a different war, though. Maybe we'll be able to get in there. HD Cyclone says, just wanted to tell you that you are perfect background noise when cooking. What you cooking? <sighs> Man, it's just such a relief that things are not dying all around me. I'd like this to keep you in line, but that doesn't seem necessary right now. I seem plenty strong enough. I'm a little over force limit, but that's okay. We have the money. And our army is really damn good. And wow. It's all going on for my subject, whilst my own vassals don't want to rise up. Basra. Of course. Kinda wish I'd erected a fort up there, so... Well, what you gonna do? I will go down and help you. It'll boost our relations a bit, and looking at the situation, we could do with that. Amen to that. Jake, you keep me at the computer working. Keep it up, says Densetsu. Well, stranger things have happened. I hear from people that listen to this in order to help themselves fall asleep. Why run away from that? You're going to destroy them. Well, my own rebels seem hesitant to rise up, so I will get to help in here. Defend their provinces is a nice boon. Spy network in Transoceana is growing nicely. I think I'm going to use the one that I have in Oman to start whapping down some claims. I can claim here and around here. Um, but I'm probably going to eat a hell of a lot out of this guy. I want Hormoz, but uh, there's quite a lot I want around here, truth be told. Hormoz is indeed part of it. Total cost of a man is quite a lot, but I want to strip this away from him. For reasons that may well become clear soon enough. Oh well, top stuff first, and I want those diamonds. Even though the New World Diamond's kind of collapsing the price of it, it's still, you know, diamonds are forever. You know how it is. Still, I should get this connection around here. I don't want more disembodied bits of land. Uh, Ottomans is influencing his subject, which means he's all... Mo well, come on, Hassa is a glorified subject at this point. I'll deal with you, and then deal with my own problems. How does that sound? And I'm using Transoceana as reduced tech cost. And I want that reduced tech cost quite a lot. Mmm, that's a shame. Malakates. I hope he doesn't torch my missionary. I mean, I'd be really sad if he torched my missionary at 93.4%. Uh, I'd be really sad. Well, he's still there, so I don't have to be sad. The increased uh, separatism is a bit of a pain, but I'll get it converted and all will be well. Quite a few conversions to be done. I should also finish off my claims on Shirvan so I can eat them up when all is said and done. Transoceana die in three years. Afghanistan could die in fewer than that, but Gujarat is a pain. I'm not even a great power, am I? That's the big joke around here. Can't even do great power actions. Troubling. Well, it's only Highlands over there. I feel confident about whooping these guys to death. Maybe I should take care of that. Yeah, I can get there in time. 
Riga. Trying to help out the Ottomans, are you? Well, balanced administrator should uh, should make life easier for me if the Ottomans are doing that. Fierce negotiator, be stubborn to surrender. I don't think I've actually seen that in action before. 15-7. Alright, I'll take back Malakate, so I want it converted on the double. Defender of the Sunni Faith is now Gujarat? Hold on, that could be a problem. No, it won't. I'm also Sunni, so never worry about that. Alright, the Omanis are bound to rise up unless the Ardabils really want to. The Ardabils would rise up in, um, in uh, this one. No need to worry about it. Of course Delhi left the coalition. Why would they even be in it? Would you show the auto army on the ledger? You mean just looking at it here isn't enough? I mean, we certainly can. Ottoman army. Almost 500,000, so half a million. At least their manpower is low, but they are churning out those mercenaries like crazy. Yeah, I mean, why wouldn't they, right? Again, things that have the most impact on my unity, they're the ones I want done. And Tibbles is over here. Which means I don't have the I don't have it as a state, so I'm not using my extra thing here. Which means it's inefficient. So I'll do the nine one instead. Hot oh, damn, I'm just too genius to handle. I read a fair bit about how humanism or religious is absolutely necessary when playing. I'll kind of agree with that if we're talking world. Conquest, they will make your life a lot easier. The game is playable without them. They are super strong though, but go figure, this was the age of religious uh, confrontation in a big way. I feel like this land should be a, uh, a state. It's really rich. Really, really rich. Now we got. Oh, the war exhaustion is still there, so it's still going to cost me to do these in. Not a huge amount, but still more than I'm willing to pay at this point, because I don't need to go to war for a while. Seven development. Sounds like a claim to me. Are we witnessing a rare time of peace in Hissen Kaifa? Yes, we are. Had to happen eventually. Uh, Malamir. Because I know where Malamir is. I do not. That was... Ah, there you are. Of course you don't want to revolt. You're Sunni. What is more, you will not revolt if I give you uh, a bunch of people. And excellent. Since we managed to get our diplomatic reputation back up, Oh, we didn't see that coming. Basha did revolt. Since we've got our diplomatic reputation back up, the Annex Subject modifier has gone away. Uh, the Timurids are being integrated at lightning fast speed. Hot damn, just look at that. That's a nice chunk of it. Ming lost? Oh, dear lord, Ming has lost. They lost against Russia, and now they're losing against Malacca and Bengal. I wanted to fight Malacca pretty soon, so uh, maybe that's not going to go the way I want it to. The emirs still want land from me, which is terribly disgusting. The emirs are nothing but trouble. I'll give them this land. It's only wool. At least they're happy with me. So advisors and army, that's what cost that's what's costing me pretty hard right now. Ardabils still wish to rise up over there. Deal with them I shall. So from becoming a great power I'm behind Blobhemia. And then there are seven nations with over a thousand development. Truly terrifying. 
This rare time of peace simply cannot last. Makes me a bit uneasy, truth be told. But yeah, we're trying to swallow up Timmy as fast as we can. I would actually love a bit of extra Diplo rep here. Oh, well, speak of the devil. And you are Azerbaijani. It's a bit expensive, but I want you at a higher skill level than you are right now. Then again, he's not half price or anything, so maybe I shouldn't. Yeah, better to have... Uh, better to have... People that are half price who I'm going to be doing that. Like this guy. But I can't, because... Wrong culture. <clears throat> right, I am loving the spy network that I have here in Transoceana. And I am sorely tempted to... Oh, I forgot about you. You got yourself an alliance with Uzbek, Gujarat, and Multan, so no thanks to that. But Trans is only allied with Multan. Multan is allied with Afghanistan. So I fight Trans, I make Multan a co-belligerent, and I chomp away Afghanistan. Sadly, they have increased corporation cost. However, there's a bug at the moment. And I am not above exploiting bugs. Well, not currently, at least. I might be able to get three techs. That would be wonderful to bring me up to speed. So, Trans is going to die in two years. Unfortunately, Ardabil have not yet uh, risen up. I kind of want to here, but it's not happening. Soon, very soon. Hopefully the Ottomans don't enter a war anytime soon. Now, there's the question. Do I want to call them into this war? They wouldn't want land. I would just be calling them in to fight against Trans, Multan, them and them. It keeps the Ottomans busy, which is worth its weight in gold. I really want them to... I need those favours to have them fight against Oman. But after that, I shouldn't really need many auto favors anymore. They're still good to have. And I can generate more by saying, hey, I'll, uh, I'll let you eat Iraq. And honestly, well, I don't really want them to have this land, truth be told. I'll at least claim this province. Yeah, keeping them busy seems like a good idea. Also means that I can relax, like I don't have to pay so much money, they do a lot of the sweeping up. It's tempting to tell them to prepare for war, but that's uh, an expensive use of favours. Two years is enough time to eat Iraq. Yeah, but I mean the Ottomans, oh, they only see the strategic utility. It's probably a good idea to grab it now before they take a mission that says we're going to take it for good. But my war exhaustion stops ticking down. Alright, I will fight them when I'm fighting Trans Oceana. And that allows me to eat, or at least fight, Shirvan again. Hell, I can white piece them and get a shorter truce. That also works out. So we increased our diplomatic reputation. I kind of want to drop this because even though I can eat... Uh, I can eat you faster with this. It is hemorrhaging my dip points. But I really want to eat them faster, and loads of diplo rep is pretty good. Conquer had it, uh, well, yes. Yes, I do want to do that. Hmm, free claim. Who's gonna say no to those? Yeah, we'll declare that war when we fight trans, which is in under two years. Jake, I'm off to work. Have a good day. Remember, the only good Ottoman is a dead Ottoman. They will die. There's no doubt about that. Poor Mamluks getting it. Oh, I think the Ottomans are getting into position to fight Mamluks. Which means fighting these guys. Yes, of course. There we go. See, I can read the Ottomans like a book. But, when it comes to trans, they... Oh, no, it's because they have a truce. 
my massive Diplo rep will bring them in, along with that good old trust. <laughs> this is good. This is very good. This is not. I need to staple somebody to him, improving relations. Sooner or later I'm going to accidentally click on send an insult. But until that day, all is well. Mogastan. Yeah, I'm not able to convert this. I could if I just manned up and stated it. Actually, if I stated it and then just used the edict times would be a lot better for me. Ramadan. Sounds like time to feast. I know it says fast. Oh, but that's kind of... I'm in an ideal point to tech up here, honestly. I've got a huge spy network on somebody that gives me a massive bonus to it. I'm high on legalism. Let's just take it. Let's just take it all. Chomp. Chomp. Oh, I'd love to chomp down a bit more. Hundred and eighty diplo points, what's the world coming to? Yes, thank you, yes, thank you, yes, thank you. Oh, I want that. I still really want it, but I can't have it. Because we're so dangerously close to getting much better Cassus Belly. Oh well, what you gonna do? We did all we could. And da 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 boom. I need to be able to kill the Ottomans. And an increased force limit's gonna help out tremendously with that. Ah, oh, finally I can have something that resembles an army. And since we already went full professional, I don't have to worry so much about, well, pretty much anything right now. I should probably start thinking about how I want to stack up my armies here. Hmm. Combat width is pretty huge. Pretty damn huge. 16, 4, 10. 16, 4, 10. That sounds good to me. Sixteen, four, ten. Good stack. No, that's stupid. Uh, Sixteen, four, ten. Saved. Which means I want you to become that, and I want you, as luck would have it, to become that. Goodbye money, goodbye manpower, hello standing army. Worth it. Hmm. No, let's just keep you stapled to the Ottomans. I'll try my luck for another claim on a man. After that, I want a free diplomat for my nefarious dealings. You don't need to balance out idea groups, is that not the case anymore? Well, that was always in the game because it was a bit unbalanced in multiplayer the way it, the way it was. Alright, I have these mercs, they can just sort off a bit. Um, so we made it toggleable, that way we can have it on multiplayer and not otherwise. Because when the game released, it wasn't the case where you had to balance them out. That was added later. Excellent. The conversions continue. I don't need to edict you guys anymore. Who will be next? Mine still doesn't want to revolt. It's kind of good for me if it does right now, so let's uh, let's make it so. Unless there's a chance to have it not happen, but it doesn't look likely. Well, no, if the next year passes, we can get rid of it. Lack of demand for carpets. That sounds impossible to me. Everybody wants my carpets. Okay. Glorious Azerbaijanis get converting. Jake, man, it's always so cool to watch good people play. I'm so bad. 
You don't have to be bad. You could be good. All right. War exhaustion is gone. It's now considerably cheap for me to... Hold on. I see that 0.2%. Where were you coming from? There we go. Let's get those cores down. Consider if there's anywhere else worth stating at this point. I mean, this is pretty okay. It contains Basra, which is an estuary. But this is a trade node that... Well, I'm going to dominate, and it's going to go here. And it's not inland, so nobody can use their accursed modifiers there. Anywhere else? Any more for any more, as I like to say? This stuff is going to be a state when I... Well, I'm going to want to state it when I integrate anyway. What I'm saying is, why not just do it? How are we looking on state limit anyway? We're only at half of it. The Ottoman, uh, the Timmies are going to give me plenty of them for sure. I'll just make it happen. It's hardly an expense, really. Right, what's the situation? How's that truce looking? December this year, so that is a case of get those forts active, regret the fact that they don't block anything. You know, I have the money, let's just activate the whole damn lot. Goodbye money. And... Those rebels are going away, these ones were never really happening, but my unit will be back soon. I need to make sure that I'm in a position to call in the auto freaks. I should have this province. My subject is converting. Great, he's actually taking his time coring, which is not so great. But he is converting, which is good. And he's fast at it, plus nine. Concerned about lack of conversions in Timmy, but there's plenty of time, and there's going to be more time after I feed him here. I will drink deep from the trans well, but yeah, I wonder if I should make more claims. No, I really just wanted this one claimed because it's uh, as important as it is. Okay. Very okay. Any particular goals before the end of the campaign? Yeah, I want the achievement. I really want Saladin's legacy. It's been over 200 years, 230 years, and I've gotten 10 of the 97 provinces, and I don't own the titular Sinkaifa, and I won't uh, even have a core in 14 years. Uh, in fact, maybe even less than that, because he's culturally enriching the place. Okay, 86, it'll be culturally enriched. All that uh, spamming of development I did to keep myself alive, and excuse me, this is what happens from it. I should be sadder than I am, but I'm still sad. I don't want those rebels in Mogistan either. Get on that. I tell you, it's nice having a hundred uh, spy network in somebody. That's not something that happens often. Oh yeah, I wanted to make sure that the Ottomans would join in. They will when truce is up. They absolutely will. Purification, eh? Mm, I mean, unrest is kind of nice. Mysticism is also nice. I really need to start going towards mysticism. Yeah, I'll take it. But I will also take some Manola. Unless there's tech to be had. There is not. Thanks for the money. I think we'll have another 40-year war with the Turks. It seems to be a recurring theme. Uh, yeah, I'm even in the Akkayunlu lands, so it's very fitting. The Turks don't want Van, but they might want it in the future. Also, I need to remember to fight Iraq during this war, but I'm sure we will have the resources to do exactly that. Peasants are upset in Sultana. Eh? 
The fort should hold out. You what? I thought that's only meant to trigger when there's a fort, but uh, maybe I remember wrong. Mm, devastation. Hissen Kaifa still because they raided this place. Uh, not Hissen Kaifa. The, uh, the other capital. But not much I can do about that. And now the emirs are wanting me. I mean, who's to blame them, but still. Uh, I'm not spending money on them. They're just going to have to sort off. Okay. Truce is up. Ottomans will join in. They, of course, won't want land. And making Multan a co-belligerent will call in... Glad I checked. They would call in Gujarat. I don't really want that. I mean, it does mean the Ottomans would soften up Gujarat for me, but I don't want to fight Gujarat. It's such a waste of resources at this point. Hmm. I might be able to make Afghanistan not... Ah, but I need to eat Afghanistan if I want to have things cheaper. them and their cursed core creation costs. Okay, decisions here. Nice Gujarat. Did Starnan take it out? Yeah, it's colossal. It's kind of terrifying in a way. Mm, they would love to save Multan. How did you relocate Hormoz, Jake? Perhaps you should repeat that maneuver. What? Oh, remember how you relocated Hormoz. I have no recollection of this whatsoever. Mm, do you believe you'll make it or not going to make it for the chief? Of course I'm going to make it. I, there's no doubt in my mind that I'm going to defeat this staggering Ottomans because we nerfed them so hard. I mean, they practically fall apart just when you look at them. That was me activating my sarcasm. Was it obvious? Sarcasm's not a good thing to use. I should feel ashamed for saying that. Okay, Afghanistan. You're allied with Uzbek, Multan, Gujarat. Multan's not an option. Gujarat's not an option. That leaves Uzbek. Uzbek are guaranteed by Russia. But uh, Russia have been having a bad time lately. Not bad enough, it seems. Mm. What is the right thing to do here? I think I'm placing too high a value on Afghanistan. I already took the Timmy cores from them. I can eat them up at a later date. Wouldn't be a big deal. They might even lose that alliance by then. Besides, me and Gujarat still get on like a house on fire, and we could well get on a bit better. Hello, friend. Transoceana, I could beat without even thinking, but do I want the Ottomans busy? It seems like a bad use of Ottoman favor when I could call them into something a lot meteor. A lot meteor. They're going to be stuck in that war for a wee bit of time. What are we looking at when it comes to trans... Yeah, they have barely have anything that can be called an army. Probably better to keep hold of those uh, Turkish favours. For now, at least. And I think I stripped them of a lot of their forts. Seems like I'm remembering wrong. They still have a fair few of them. Alright, well, you know what? I might not need to use those favours, but need and desire are completely different things. Don't mix them up. Come on, my friend. This is a reconquest for Timmy Lands. Especially Urgench. Because it's high, high development stuff. So make it happen. Go to Gujarat with the Ottomans. Tech 22. Probably utterly enormous. Hang on, what? Oh, right, they have a positive opinion. Of course, they're not showing up. Even so, 200k, Ottomans 4 and 73k, there's no guarantee the Ottomans will mobilize all the way down here. And what would I even do with Gujarat? I kind of want them to be my friend. Oh. Huh. 
Well, that makes life easier. Welcome to the family, Gujarat. <laughs> 